Hey guys, how are you all doing? How's your day going? And if it's just starting, how was your night? Hope you had or are having an amazing day. Well, um, if you've been following all these tutorials I've been doing on TikTok Live, or if you saw the playlist I did them 10 days, I'm um, learning Python in 10 days, it was a crash course. You'll notice I never mentioned anything about Python constants, even though almost every single programming language has the ability to define a constant so by default or basically python doesn't allow you to create constants although there is a model that you can import to use to carry out this action so now you'll be like why didn't i introduce this when i was talking about data types and all that well it's because working with this model you first need to actually understand models know how to import models and working with class so we had a lot of things we needed to cover before we jumped into this so i just like to just wait but it's really simple so we're just going to get to it it's very very simple you already know how to import models so we're going to be importing from the enum model so that is enum so from enum import enum but with a capital e okay so from enum import enum so this enum model is the model that allows us to create constants so this constant is going to be enclosed in the class so remember how to call class you make use of the class function and you can give it any class name of your choice and your class names usually start with a capital letter but now you, well, you know remember when we were talking about inheritance so when you want to inherit from a class that's when you're not passing parentheses we're just creating a plain class you just call the class name put your indentation whatever shit and just continue your code but we're going to inherit from this enum class so you know how to inherit just passing the name of the class you're inheriting from passing your column and jump to the next line it's not in this line you're going to call all the um all the um constants you want to create so let's create a constant named i preferably everything should be named in capital letter and assign the value we want to enclose in it so that's going to be 3.14 i hope that is high i can't remember i've not had to use it in a while but um now how do we access this well there are multiple ways to access it but if you want to access the value accessing the value is by using class i'm um, sorry you want to access the value you're going to call the name of the class which is pi dot the name of the value we want to um call from the class dot pi and dot since we want to get the value you're seeing writing value as in name so we'll get the name shortly so value and let's just print it All right, save it and run it without debugging. And they printed it out for us. So what if we wanted to get the name? To get the name is really easy. So what we're going to do, we'll change this value to name. And then this pi with code here, we're going to clean up and clean this dot. So it's pi dot name, but we're going to pass in the parentheses here. And enclosed in the parentheses is going to be the name of the value we want to call. We want like the value we want to get the name for. So the value assigned is 3.14. So we will save it and we will run it. It's going to print the name that has that contains this value we just passed, which is obviously pi. So yeah, that's how you declare um constants in Python. If you have any questions, feel free to ask me in the comment section below. But yeah, have a beautiful rest of your day. And I'll be seeing you all today by 11 p.m. I wasn't able to go live yesterday because I wasn't feeling my best. But I'll be seeing you all today. I'm going to be working on multiple Python projects. So if you're interested in that, um, you know, comment the project you want me to work on in the description below so we can have a lot of projects and you can get this project, get the source code and use it to practice Python. But here, yeah, have a good first video. Bye, guys.